Oh boy. Well, I've always wanted to do this. I have been waiting for a very long time to cover this. So, yes, I know. Cable is dying. But there is a little catch there. It can manage to thrive. Even though we have streaming, which people prefer to pay 10 to $15 a month on the streaming service instead of paying $60 a month on a cable package. Which is understandable, but then again, streaming is basically cable 2.0. However, I do have to show you something very interesting. Nick Jr. has its own, Nick Jr. the channel. The schedule is... How should I say this politely? A bit repetitive. And it doesn't change. Such a shame there, but... Well, let's see what we have in Nick Jr.'s schedule. Alright, so this is Nick Jr.'s current lineup. And as you can see, this is Monday. So, as of this recording, it's tomorrow. So, I start out with Peppa. Then more Peppa. And then even more Peppa. Then Blaze. Then Abby Hatcher at 2.57. And then Shimmer and Shine at 3.20 a.m. And then Hey Dougie at 3.43 because why not? Honestly, Hey Dougie does need more reruns than... Well, it shouldn't have that much reruns, but it does need more reruns than just one tiny little rerun at 3.43 a.m. Then Rainbow Rangers, which I thought Nick Jr. lost the rights to because uh, it's on Cartoon Channel. There's no need of airing Rainbow Rangers. I thought they lost the rights. Um, okay, Doran Friends into the City. Fun fact, Nick Jr. does this. Every time one show's run ends of their reruns, they bring it back to the other one. And it's always Dorn Friends in the City and Fresh Beat Band of Spies. It gets repetitive when it comes to this, when they do this every single time. Hopefully they make like a different replacement there, but I doubt it. Such a shame. Then Team Umi Zoomy. Alright, then Paw Patrol. Uh, looks like an hour Paw Patrol. Blue's Closing You, and then Santiago Disease. Then Team Umi Zoomy. And Blaze, and Bubble Guppies, Blue's Clues, Baby Sharks, Big Show, Peppa Pig, Paw Patrol, Santiago, Blue, Paw Patrol, Blaze. Let's have a little bit of variety though. Paw Patrol, Sponge Paw Patrol, Blaze, Paw Patrol, Blue's Clues, and you, Peppa, more Peppa, oh jeez. I guess Peppa Pig is we ran a lot on Nick Jr. <laughs> uh, Bubble Guppies and Blues Clues and you. Wow. A little disappointing. Let's see if the weekend lineup is any better. Alright, here's the weekend lineup. Peppa Pig, Peppa Pig, Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig, Blaze, Abby Hatcher, Shimmer Ch it's, it's just, it's the same one. Hey Dougie, them Rainbow Rangers, them Fresh Beat Band of Spies, see, you see what I'm going there? They always do a, like a clockwork on Dorm Friends and Fresh Beat Band of Spies. Then Team Umi Zoomy, then Ryan, okay we have something different, I mean I don't care about Ryan but it's different, then Team Umi Zoomy, Peppa, Peppa, Blue's Clues, Bubble Guppy, Baby Shark, Paw Patrol, Santiago, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, Bubble Guppies, Bubble Guppies, Peppa Pig, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, Baby Sharks, Big Show, Blues, Clues, Blues, Cause You, Sanitary Seas, Blazing the Monster Machines, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, Paw Patrol, Baby Shark, Blues, Clues, and You, Peppa, Peppa, so much Peppa, sheesh, that's a lot of Peppa, Bubble Guppies, Blues, Clues, and You, yeah, their lineup is not the best. I mean, you... I mean, they aired the Beat Buds, I believe. Why couldn't they rerun that? Plus, didn't they air Kinderwood? And I heard they also aired JoJo and Grand Grand. I guess those were off the schedule, too. 
Such a shame because Kinderwood is a Noggin exclusive series. And JoJo and Grand Grand had their US debuted there. They're not treating acquired shows right. Even though back then Nick Jr. did do something bad, which is airing shows that didn't fit their demographic. Burning off female aimed animated shows like Cuckoo and Regal Academy there, and airing shows like Alvin and Rise of the Team and Team. This channel it's it's just repetitive. There's little to no difference on the weekday and weekend lineups. And the way they always do clockwork on both Fresh Bee Band of Spice and Dorn Friends in the City. Oh man. They should have aired the other they should where's Sunny Day? Where's more reruns of Abby Hatcher? Where's um Where's Classic Door even? Where's Classic Blues Clues? Where are the Classic Noggin Shows? They honestly should make a Nick Rewind of Noggin Shows at night. If that fits there. Um, but yeah. Their lineup is not the best. But hey, it's at least better than Nicktoons lineup. A little bit better. Anyway, guys, what do you think of Nick Jr.'s current lineup? Is it is it repetitive? Like my opinion of it, to me, it's just repetitive. It does need a little more work. Anyway, guys, this is Kawhi Life Antonio. Sign up.